Here we have Patrick. Hey Patrick, how's it uh, in the dink? Oh good. This is my finest hour. This, I'm so this is glad. This is your punishment, right? <laughs> what did I do? Oh yeah, you said somebody is gonna have to get in and I went. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Idiot. Alright, so uh, the torpedo is going. It's uh it's about 1930 hours. We're still about five miles away from uh, La Cruz and uh, the dink is pushing us at about a knot and a half and uh, there's a uh, Goff right there. Hi Goff. Hey. <laughs> All right so that's about it. So the torpedo not very good for towing. Uh, we couldn't get her get going off the bow and um, uh, so on the quarter here we're okay uh, doing a knot and a half. Not exactly the swiftest and most powerful of little uh, outboard engines but um, and a little bit funky to uh, to run as well. You gotta have a little patience on the throttle. Alrighty, hopefully we get there tonight. Okay, the Torquedo uh, battery pack. First of all, it doesn't weigh very much. Uh, about 10 pounds or so, maybe a little bit more. So I'm not sure what kind of battery is in there. Not a very large one. Anyway, solid red here means that it is fully charged. Flashing means it's charging. It took a while, it took hours in fact, uh, for this to cool down after being in use on the outboard. Especially in uh, mid-80s uh, degree temperatures uh, here in Puerto Vallarta. Um, so it took a long time to cool down even before it started the charge. So by the time it started the charge, it was hours later. And now uh, I think somewhere right around 10 hours or so, 8 hours. Uh, after it was set on full of charge, um, I mean, power was consistent, then it uh, charged fully. I don't have an exact time it took for the uh, battery pack to charge because it was off and on power. Now for the DC one, this was plugged in right around the same time and has uh, been on charge by the same uh, length of time. And it's already dark. It's, uh, heck, it's, uh, well... We're talking more than 12 hours since uh, we put these uh, originally on charge. Anyway, not scientific by any circumstance. But still, at 1900 hours the following day, this is still in charge mode <laughs> using uh, DC power. That's crazy. Yeah, that's just not doable. Not if you want to use the uh, Takedo uh, outboard to go in and out of the harbor. Uh, just one in and out of a, a short transit is going to take all your battery power.